I wasn't responsible for meeting you in the first place. I don't know why you're blaming me. Yeah. Hey, say, Scott. Yeah. You know, the other day I was at the doctor's office and he came in and he said, you know, I have some bad news for you, sir. You're going to have to stop masturbating. And I said, why? He said, I'm trying to examine you. <laughs> uh, that, would, that would make perfect sense. That's awesome. <laughs> And that means it's murder hobo night, folks. Uh, well, <laughs> Lord, we're doing the one shot tonight. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching us later. Follow us on Twitch. Follow us on Twitter. Take a look at our YouTube archive. If you want to buy our cool stuff, it's there. If you want to chat with us, it's there. Look at all this, man. We got swag out the ass here. Uh, if you want a seat on the show, get a hold of us. Let us know. Any one of these guys can uh, say no. You suck. Uh, but after <laughs> play tonight, I'm sure you'll disagree and you'll be able to do it just fine. Oh, yeah. uh, don't, forget our, <laughs> don't forget our talk show on Tuesday. Uh, tonight, we have a really crappy episode. Absolutely horrible. It's probably one of the worst ones we're ever going to do. Maybe you like it. Maybe you don't. Uh, we shall see. Uh, we'll go ahead and get to the background here in just a second. Let's introduce you to the team. Uh, starting out, David, who are you and who are you playing tonight? I am... David, <laughs> and I'll be playing Magnus. He is uh, a human champion fighter. So, yeah, let's see if he can uh, stay alive long enough to finish. <laughs> first level, I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm sure, it'll it's be fine. fine. Uh, next up, uh, everybody's favorite paladin, uh, Scott. Who are you? Who are you playing? Yes, I'm playing um, Scott. I'm a DM uh, most of the time, but I but I'm a player most of the time with these guys. Uh, I'm playing Eric called Justice Man, who is uh, starting out first level, uh, and uh, he is a devout follower of Heronius, as he has recently found the calling to be a knight and found his true place in the world because he has this problem with his hair lip, and people have been making fun of him his whole life. But once Heronius has discovered him and brought him into the fold, he has found his true calling. <laughs> <laughs> oh man wow that's the first time i heard that spiel that's awesome <laughs> next up blake blake who are you who are you playing marriage marriage is what brings us marriage <laughs> Two love i am going to be playing karen I am the Tabaxi Rogue. I have just uh, established a very successful career in human resources. Uh, and uh, I've decided to uh, <laughs> be let go from the company. And now I'm uh, venturing out on my own. You should contact the manager. Yeah, I was about to say. <laughs> Last but certainly not least, Kyle. Kyle, who are you? Who are you playing tonight? I'm Kyle. I'm exhausted, so don't expect a lot from me. Oh, God. My wife said I can't tell any of those jokes that I told last time I was on. A little, a little and you don't even have your green screen. I miss no, them. Right? <laughs> uh, but I will be playing uh, the Gith Yankee wizard, uh, Gara Ulala of the Roma Roma Ma clan. God, I hated that name. I hated typing that name into the fucking nameplate. I really did. <laughs> what the hell kind of name? Oh, wow. Wait a minute. <laughs> and, and, and you need to address that on your screen so that I can call you that. God, oh. yes. uh, folks, uh, as we pointed out, these guys, all four of them, first level. <laughs> this is how they started. This is their origin story, if you will. Uh, they have come together at the town of podunk uh and found out that there is a job available at the temple uh for a little bit of guard duty considering their complete lack of experience uh they have jumped on the bandwagon to train get some coin and get some fame and fortune for their name at the temple uh they are going to meet the high priestess tora taval uh gentlemen you walk in the acolytes lead you to a small chamber uh, where 
a woman dressed in priestial robes is next to a large knightly figure wearing a helmet made of copper. Uh, she has you sit at some seats available and asks you what your qualifications are. Who would like to start? I'd like to say, boo! How does the knight in the copper react? He doesn't. Oh. Oh, <laughs> hold on. You thought it was a man? You assumed? Assumed it was a man. Huh, God, that was, that That's was right. A... I'm offending early tonight. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Go uh, pink all way in your armor there. The knight does this. <laughs> uh, the high priestess <laughs> looks at the other three and asks um, anyone else? I present a rather uh, substantial CV uh, and uh, demand, to, demand, demand to speak to his supervisor. <laughs> uh, oh, my God. supervisor is where you are going. Uh, I will assume that each one of you can handle this job for no apparent reason whatsoever. Uh, adventurers have recently brought us a relic of Imix, uh, and we need oh. to get it to the High Bishop, Imix. I am I X. Uh, yes, that's terrible. Uh, everybody, religion check for me. See if you recognize this. Oh, I am so gonna fail that. Yep. <laughs> I rolled an eight. <laughs> that's a, a thirteen. Eleven. Karen. I, I was a twenty-one. Oh, okay. Karen knows that it's uh, some kind of bullshit lizard uh, sect. Uh, doesn't believe that they have any place in this universe at all. Uh, but that is all she knows. Uh, the high priestess points out that uh, initially uh, her second in command, uh, the constable, was going to go ahead and handle this job. But she wanted to make sure that he was well guarded as he is a true asset uh, to uh, the, the order. Also, uh, she has heard that none of you are clerics and probably figured you would need it. The what? individual speaks and reiterates his position that he doesn't feel the need to go ahead and have to babysit new adventurers. Everybody roll perception check, please. Eight. Also an eight. Fifteen. Fifteen. Uh, for some reason, Ericall recognizes the voice. Magnus does not. Uh, the high priestess turns to the constable and says, it is for the best. This way you have backup. It'll be fine. I will I will try to allay the high priestess's fears. Say, so introduce myself as I am ever called Justice Man. I come from a long line of the Justice Man family. You may have heard of us because I am a noble within my own right. My father was I also the constable a puts his hand up, <laughs> grabs his helmet, and lifts it. I know who you are. <laughs> <laughs> Ericall Justice Man recognizes this individual as Minister Justice Man. And you have a chat message. <laughs> Clearly, this man, all three of you will recognize there are some similarities to some extent. I think what I detected was sarcasm. So, <laughs> uh, While Ericall digests the fact that his associate is quite familiar with him. The man says, let's get this done before nightfall because it shouldn't take us that long. Do you guys have horses? No. Uh, oh, um, oh. Um, Brand new adventures. <sighs> I we couldn't afford those. The mascot. Uh, Constable, a.k.a. Uh, Minister Justice Man, turns to High Priestess, Milady, I will take care of them. Without horses, it will be a slow trip, but we should be there before midnight. Uh, she wishes you the best, and he does this. Come along. I love it when you oh. finger me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I only misread that situation. 
you guys go outside. His horse is ready. He is carrying a box, a very small box, and he secretes it down inside his armor. Um, <clears throat> he goes, are you familiar with where we're going? We're going. We're going to St. Louis. Oh. Is it a history check or survival? Yeah, you guys can do a history check. Uh, 22. 18. 21. I'm in a negative, so I, <laughs> this won't be spectacular. 11. <laughs> Good enough. It's above 10. St. Louis is a major city in this area, and it's also home to uh, the High Bishop. Surprise, surprise, surprise. Uh, the constable quickly gets astride his horse and goes, Cousin. Maybe you can weed us out. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I don't know why you like to do that. You know how much mother used to hate it when you did that. I know she was blind and she always favored you. And she always, but, but she said you were supposed to protect me. And I haven't you, mean you have to follow me around. I'm more than happy to take care of myself. <laughs> you are going to test my patience. Just, just oh. listening to the two of you speak, I could tell why mother liked him more. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Erica, uh, Karen, and Gaga Olala. Uh, you all know that the main road from Podunk will take you directly to St. Louis. Uh, the constable looks down at you guys and he goes, let's just get a move on. I could have done this much faster myself. Lead us out, please, lady and gentlemen. Head down the road. He's on I'm down the road. I'm going to prove myself to you before this is done. Uh -huh. I will. Because of my unusually lightweight and my keen no. instinct, I think it might be good. <laughs> no. If I were to. No. <laughs> uh, you can tell that the constable is already dreading this choice. I, I want to watch his six on the horse. No. My six is just fine. This is a trained speed. Uh, Eric Hall, you will know that he has a few years on you, so he is probably yeah. higher level. Uh, uh, perception check to see exactly how fine his six is. It's Karen. She doesn't get out much. <laughs> his charisma is a 17. I will not disagree. <laughs> Lead on, future heroes. Let's get this over with. Uh, <laughs> the first two hours of travel go uneventfully. You cross over the grasslands. You pass by several farms. Erica, you are going to take repeated abuse uh, from your relative. Uh, I'm, document I'm documenting all of it for uh, for, for, for HR purposes. For yeah. HR purposes. Uh, yeah. He will remind you that you are his subordinate on a frequent basis. Uh, he points out that the halfway point is the bridge over the River Kwai, and let's just get there without issue. Uh, as you come to a fork in the road, I'm going to need a uh, insight check, please, from everybody. 19. 21. I, I rolled a 19 and a 20, my uh, last two rolls. Nice. Uh, 12. Uh, Magnus, you are pretty much clueless. Uh, mm. Everybody else notices that there is a sign of a recent passing here. Uh, it looks like a small campfire has been hastily put out. Uh, the road forks, and uh, Minister Justice Man says, to the left, ladies, to the left, let's keep moving. Day, <laughs> days are waning. Uh, you go about another half hour and the sun is really hot. Uh, Eric Hall, he continues to pepper you with insults, pointing out that he was really surprised that the order had sank so low as to go ahead and accept you, let alone graduate you. Uh, <laughs> you uh, everybody perception check. And this he, is, he, this he, is he always looks like this. <laughs> <laughs> 
God damn, 12. <laughs> 19. I'm going to switch to real yeah. days. <laughs> oh, Gog. Uh, 11. <laughs> Uh, only Karen notices as Ericol uh, continues to ingest the insults. Uh, actually, let me check something. Oh, no. Oh, uh, yes. Minister also notices, and he looks down at you, Ericol, and goes, smoke. <laughs> uh, Karen, you do indeed see smoke just up ahead. Uh, the minister, minister justice man, Furrows his brow and gives a scowl. Uh, if, if, if the others didn't hear the, the moon, I'll point it out to. Uh, <laughs> no, we didn't hear that. Uh, yeah. So uh, as you round the bend uh, around some trees, you notice that the smoke is coming from the bridge, and you also notice. There are several figures there responsible for it. Uh, there are four individuals, and you hear a groan come from under the helmet, uh, the copper helmet of uh, the cleric, uh, Minister Justice Man. <laughs> and he goes, well, this is not going to be pleasant. Uh, everybody give me... Uh, who, who knew about it? Just Karen, right? On the religion? Uh, yeah. Think so, uh, Karen, you will notice that the four individuals are wearing cloaks emblazoned with the symbol of Imix. Uh, also, Mr. Justice Man recognizes that as well. And he goes, hang on, guys. This is where it gets ugly. Unsheathe well, your weapons. Yeah, and I'll, I'll explain why we're doing that to everyone else. Uh, let's go with initiative against the four human individuals. Oh, oh, oh you guys are fucked already. <laughs> There's Seven. Seven. Eleven. Uh, fourteen. Did you say seven, Karen? Thirteen. Thirteen. Oh, that was air call. I had seven. Ah, so thirteen here and seven here. Twenty-two here. Uh, the four individuals wearing what appears to be mage apparel, uh, come, uh, you know what? No, I'm going to shoot at each one of you with my crossbow and let you come to me. Uh, Magus, Magnus, 17 plus four. Ericol, 14 plus four. Two for Karen. <laughs> Two. Uh, for Gaga. Uh, Magnus and Ericol, you are both going to take crossbow bolts. Oh, that sucks. Yet. Uh, three hit points of damage. Uh, battle has been engaged. Uh, are you guys going to charge or what would you like to do? How far are we? Yeah, I was going to ask. Probably 30 feet. Yeah. Well, as you ponder, you hear, "Hi ho, Silver!" Uh, Ericol. Oh no! <laughs> give me a DC twelve dexterity as uh, your associate Steed accidentally careens into you. <laughs> uh. <laughs> what you 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 need a? Oh, sorry, I thought you needed to roll the D twelve. No, DC twelve dex. No. Nope. Uh, you get knocked off the road into uh, the. Uh, trench. Uh, you will be out of it this round as your uh, cousin knocks you in as he charges forward. Uh, next up is the 14. Gaga. Uh, yeah, I'll run forward and I'll uh, cut one of them down with a great sword. Cool. Uh, AC 14. Um, yeah, I think a 19 will hit then. Mm -hmm. Okay. That is 11 damage. Holy shit. Uh, yeah, you cut him down in half. Yeah. Uh, next up is the 13, uh, which is Ericol, or no, which is uh, Karen. I'm going to hold my turn until I can sneak attack one of the others. Okay. Uh, Magnus. Uh, standing next to <laughs> Gaga. <laughs> uh, I'm going to charge in and strike with the greatsword. Okay. 
not with a one. No, but you are right next to Gaga. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's see if I could pull that sword before I hit him. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> How much damage halved are you going to give him? Oh my god. Uh six six points. That's halved? That's halved. It, well, uh are, are we talking oh sorry. <laughs> uh four points. Okay. Yeah. Sorry about that. I was like doing the maximum dice thing. I was like, oh no. Don't worry, I'm just a wizard. That's half my health. <laughs> Uh, fortunately, Minister Justice Man had his horse run over one of those fuckers, and that guy is dead as Lincoln. Uh, seven, Ericall, uh, you can well, drag yourself out. Well, uh, well seeing the, that, that'll trigger my health action, seeing him engage. Sure, go ahead. Uh, so I'm going to pounce up. He's dead, you know that, right? The, the one that, the one that, that David just whiffed at? Mm -hmm. Oh no! Uh, yeah, th that guy's still up. Yeah, yeah that, that's up. the one that that's that's the one that I'm sneak attacking. Okay, gotcha. So uh, I'm going to essentially pounce up over him and come down with two short swords. Straight up D twenty. Uh, uh, five. <laughs> uh, one of your short swords will attack normally the other will attack at disadvantage as you catch the earlobe of magnus who was turned the wrong way towards gaga uh -oh. <laughs> uh, that's first one is going to be a 14 to hit oh uh, that hits okay uh and the second one is going to be the low is a nine. Ah, uh, no. Yeah, okay. that's, that one. So I do six plus one d six. So nine. Dead. New round. Uh, there is only one left. Uh, I will choose. Well, Eric uh, Paul was going to get up, wasn't he? Yeah, he's getting up, but he won't oh, yeah. be able to yeah. attack this round. Uh, he is covered in water from a recent rain. Uh, I am going to be number two. So if two comes up, the sole remaining Imix associate will go after the cleric. And it is a three, so it will pounce at Karen uh, because it does not like HR. Uh, and Miss Wildly with an Eldritch Blast. Uh, 14. Gaga ooh la la. Hate that name. <laughs> you love it and you know it. Uh, 14 was to hit. Yep. All right. That is not as good. Nine. Dead. Uh, Erica wanders up and uh, Minister looks down and goes, Oops. <laughs> Don't, don't, don't do that again. You did that on purpose. <laughs> Cousin, I would never knowingly jeopardize all of our livelihoods by knocking you into the trench on purpose. Yes, you would. Just like that time that you put that, that, that horse piss into my drink and then, and then made, me, made me drink it in front, of, in front of Sharon. And Sharon said she liked me. <laughs> While uh, Eric Call is distracting him, can I cast Mage Hand, which is an invisible Mage Hand, and slowly start to undo the saddle so uh, Cleric <laughs> Justice Man will eventually, at some point in this adventure, go upside down? <laughs> yeah, sure, that's fine. Uh, let me roll Perception. Okay. Do what you need to do. Uh, uh, er, er, Eric Hall, he reminds you that uh, he was Sharon's first. We have a, we have a very strict anti fraternization policy here. I have to remind everyone. Okay. <laughs> uh, Minister Justice Man gets off his horse and goes over to look at the bridge. Uh, this fantastic uh, feat of construction is fucked. 
uh, and you're going over essentially the Missouri River, uh, but you ain't so getting there is, there right is no now. bridge over troubled waters. That's right. Uh, the the River Kwai is uh, not going to be crossed here. He thinks for a minute and says, "Well, we take the long way. I will leave it up to you. We can go through the mountains to the north." or down along the coast through the swamp to the south. Why don't you, you brave heroes figure it out? Hmm. I don't want to get wet. You don't want to get wet. Hmm? Then I'll not use my seduction techniques on you, Karen. <laughs> I told you already we had an anti-fraternization policy. I, I <laughs> that. You may report me when we get there. I will. Well, we are all in. I, I don't think your your horse would do too well in this swamp. So let's let's try the mountains. Our tax will do just fine. Our in the swamp. <laughs> <laughs> well, mountains it is. <laughs> Lead on, ladies. Uh, off in the distance, you can see the mountains are home to a singular volcano. That is just putting out light puffs of smoke, similar to Karen's uh, hookah. <laughs> what was the name uh, of the lady, Susan? Erica? Sharon. 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 I'm sorry, I get them all mixed up. There were so many in our youth. <laughs> you know, I did, I did know one of them that did like you. Have you been checked for chlamydia lately? Really? I heal myself. <laughs> my associate brother Tamlin will go ahead and cure me <laughs> and I lay on hands yet I touch myself oh. <laughs> uh, really? no uh, yes Erica I remember one young lady remember the blind deaf idiot I think she had a thing for you FYI I was her first as well uh, you mean your mother? No, no I, that, that I was, was on a rumor. second. <laughs> <laughs> that was a rumor. Apparently, my father was very, very wealthy. He was very ugly, but the village says that he was very well endowed. And my mother, she was blind and she was a nymphomaniac. So they apparently made a very successful couple. Nice. <laughs> Uh, I'm, 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 afraid, I'm afraid to have to point this out, but I believe your mother was a prostitute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Wait, you're just going to hear about this. <laughs> I already have. Whore lives matter. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if you're going to be a whore, be the best damn whore you can be. Just follow right protocol. Exactly. As you get into the mountains, uh, the terrain is slow going and problematic. It's like you're going through Peru or Chile on those really tiny ledges. Uh, I will take uh, dex checks from everybody and him and his horse he rode in on. That's a 17. Uh, 18. 18 and a 20. Now I roll high. <laughs> uh, Got mine's a 19. Gaga? 19 as well. So you guys are all making your way slowly but surely along. Uh, you feel a slight tremor on the trail. Uh, and everybody notices uh, the mountain has belched a little more smoke than before. Uh, we, have to, we have to sacrifice the minister to it. Minister <laughs> Justice Man points out, uh, unless you guys want to be deep fried, maybe you pick up the pace a little bit more. Why? Why? Why would we? Why would? Why would my flying? I I, I don't understand. Do you do you, do you remember like what that one time when we had the the really really thin pieces of potato? Yes, they were really good. That's that's what you'll turn into if we don't go fast. A potato, a deep fried potato, it's just <sighs> salty, very delicious. Well then, we better hurry up. Concurred. Will we? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> 
All right. Wow, we, we, you we are white. <laughs> start to move faster. Go ahead and give me another check, please. 20. That's a 10. Uh, 13. I'm going to get a 17. Uh, the 11 is not going to be good enough. You are going to slip. Uh, Did Tabaxi get advantage? What? Does the Tabaxi get advantage? I don't think so. I have, I have, a, I have a natural climb. Uh, do you have a natural fall? <laughs> <laughs> would, I, would I get a reflex check to try and grab on? Nope. That's the check that you made. Uh, I thought I thought we were making the walking check. Uh, you're making uh, the check so that you don't fall off the ledge, right? And then I and you made an eleven, right? And with my cat claws, <laughs> my I, I'm not I, I know, but my cat claws I can essentially dig in. Yeah, you'll we, be digging in as you're falling. Somebody grab him, please. I will do my best to grab him. <laughs> I also rolled a ten. Oh, uh, somebody grab Ericall. Oh, Lord. <laughs> I'll, I'll grab the cat if you want to grab the, the knight. Uh, I'll grab Ericall. <laughs> uh, what's your roll? Try and hit him. Okay, roll to hit. <laughs> oh. Yeah, well, I got the cat. Uh, Magnus does not get him, but fortunately... Minister Justice Man is just as quick on the lariat and with a 19 manages to catch Ericall <laughs> by the ankle. <laughs> <laughs> and slowly backs his mount Artax backwards, dragging you up the side, giving you a nice road rash. Uh, oh. The Tabaxi and Ericall are dragged safely back onto the ledge with no injuries. Uh, and your cousin looks at you disapprovingly. <laughs> you, 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 you didn't have to do that. I would have been fine. Yes, I know you would have been fine floating well, well, like well, the well, well, no, you are in the river. If they freshen up the wound, maybe it'll heal properly. Maybe, maybe I should just cut him. <laughs> Continue on, please. Uh, you come to making fun of me as you round the corner. Yeah, but you're getting your lore out of the way, so that's the <laughs> that's the as, as, you, as you round the corner, you see that the trail opens up and there is a small campfire with two travelers <laughs> present. They look at you, pull down their cloaks, friend or foe. What, what are they? Uh, well, that's a derogatory question. Yeah, it is. They are fire newts wearing chain mail. I will take nature checks from all of you. Oh, Lord. Yeah, that's just a straight 11 for me. I don't know anything about them. Nine. Are, are you rolling a D20, Magnus, or like a D12? <laughs> yeah, I rolled a 20, but uh, just, yeah. it. Uh, Karen and Gaga, you would recognize the fact that these creatures uh, would probably be prevalent uh, among the volcano. Uh, and the booming voice of Minister Justice Man goes, we are friend to those who deserve it. Who might you be? And Ericall, you notice that uh, your cousin has moved his horse up very close next to you. Very close. I mean, his foot is like right here in the stirrup. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I try to back away just a little bit, you know, so it's not so close to me this time. <laughs> Don't stand so close. Uh Minister Justice Man moves his horse up and to the left. <laughs> and says, I, I can't take it anymore. <laughs> and I kicked the fucking horse right in the nuts. Just I, I was about to, I was about to say <laughs> Oh, oh, wait, wait. Oh, this, this could go so badly. 
<laughs> That's much better. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, hit our tax in the nuts. <laughs> oh God! While he's standing behind it, right? An arm. Yep. <laughs> An arm strike. Oh, the that could be a seventeen. Oh, oh yeah, 17. yeah. You get him right in the punching bag. Seventeen, <laughs> and that'll be four points of bludgeoning damage. <laughs> That's good enough to cause the horse to start. Let's see if your cousin saves on his decks. He does not because his saddle has been loosened and topples backwards on the <laughs> Aerocall. <laughs> <laughs> Lands with a plop. Uh, Magnus, Gaga, Karen, what would you like to do now that all hell has broken loose? Oh, wipe the tears from my eyes from laughing so hard. <laughs> I'm going to start shoving the cleric off the side of the cliff. <laughs> he, he is quite large and quite heavy. Get, so get the box first. He get also the box. has a stop. So. Get the box. Uh, I, I would like to engage the fire newts in conversation. I was going to say, since none of you are paying attention to the fire newts, uh, Karen, you notice they're pulling blades. <laughs> oh, God. And you can, I, get a, can, can I get a charisma check to say check to try and you can uh, after you roll initiative normally <laughs> Magnus Gaga initiative at disadvantage Eric Hall, you and your cousin ain't gonna do shit <laughs> this round but go ahead and roll for your initiative to see what happens next eighteen fourteen twenty one. Hey, you finally beat somebody. Eric Hall? Ten. Ten. Minister <laughs> got five. Uh, oh, Eighteen. What do you want to do, Karen? Uh, I, I'm, I'm going to uh, try and bullshit my way through it and just, I, you know, forgive my friends here. They're idiots. They, they're related. They, they, they have the same mother and, this, and different brothers. I, it's a long story. Uh, we apologize. We don't mean to cause a disturbance. Uh, we have the situation well in hand. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be reporting all of them to the superiors. Thanks, Han Solo. Uh, roll persuasion. I'm going to roll insight. Uh, nat 20 and a 7. Okay. I wasn't really trying to be deceitful, but uh, that's going to be a, a 17. Uh, you're going to cause one to stop and not do anything this round. The other one doesn't give a shit he's looking for uh some damage uh so uh you talked 14 I gaga would, you're I, up. I would be essentially closest to them probably at that point correct go ahead gaga you're up next sure give me Give me a wisdom saving throw, please. One or both? Uh, just one. Uh, the one Pro coming for the attack. 12 plus wisdom. Zero. 12. All right. I put the fear of Lady Gaga into him. <laughs> and he is now frightened and cannot approach any closer. Just you, though, or at all? Well, considering we're all on the trail, a cliff face. He literally now, remember, it's, it's opened up here. Otherwise, the cleric and Eric Hall would have gone over. Uh, uh, we're Both still on me. this side of it. In any there. way, he cannot do so. Oh, okay, that's fine. Uh, next up is the 12. The other one will... I don't want to use any spells yet. Uh, I'm going to step up three feet and blow fire out of my mouth. Uh, I will target uh, one, two, three, four, or five, six. Wasn't the other one uh, too persuaded not to attack this round? Uh, no, he was just delayed. Uh, five, Gaga, he's spitting at you. Uh, he's, he's like a little flamethrower. Go ahead and give me DC 11 versus Dex. Just save for half. Pass. Save for half. 
one. Uh, one hit point uh, as you must just be out of range. Uh, next up is the 10, but you're getting up. Six, Magnus. Uh, mm. Ericol and Minister are rolling around each other. I, I don't There may be some cheap shots by one or the other, I'm guessing. <laughs> you always making yeah. <laughs> let me get up evil era call <laughs> i'm gonna uh attack the one that spit fire okay okay so let's see how that goes Ooh, 20 yeah yeah that'll hit okay there. i hit him he's got a scar Seven points of slashing oh, oh, oh. damage. Uh, very nice. Ooh, these fuckers are hit hard. Uh, top of the order, 18. Karen, you're up. Oh, he's, he's muted. muted. Magnus is, is engaged with that one, then, correct? Mm -hmm. Correct. Okay, then that's <clears> the one <throat> that I have to go after. That's going to be a uh, low roll is a 14. Uh, no. Okay, so then the dirty 20 will hit. 16 is your magic number for these okay. guys. Uh, I'm going to do two plus six plus three. 11. 11 slashing. Okay. Uh, 14. Gaga. Yep. <clears throat> I will uh, pull out a tuning fork and bang it against the great sword. And the, uh, the uh, feared... Um, I have him roll another wisdom saving throw. 10. 10. Did he take damage yet or no? No. Mm -mm. Okay. He's just afraid. He's feared for his life. Yeah, he should be. Uh, he takes four necrotic damage. Mm. As now I he's hurt. Dead. Yep. Uh, he is going to breathe fire at... Uh, it's got to be Magnus or Karen. Odd Magnus, even Karen. Two Karen. Karen, give me a DC 11 dex. Save for half, please. Uh, and the other one will odd even. That's a five, so he's going to attack Magnus. I, um, I, I passed. So you take half of eight, four. Uh, 16 plus three to Magnus. I assume that hits. Uh, yes, it does. Six, two plus one. Three to you. Three. Uh, ten is up next. Ericol. Okay, so I'm going to take my hand, <clears throat> and stick it down my pants, stick my finger in my ass. Oh and then, no! And then pull it out, and then rub the minister's nose all in it. Oh! 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 oh. oh. It's a brown nose. Oh! Right. Do you remember when you used to do this to me? Fair <laughs> enough. Uh, that brings us to Magnus. Okay. Uh, I'm going to attack the fire dude again. So, same one. Uh, not with a nine. Not with a nine. Ericol, save versus wisdom. <laughs> 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 um, 14 is your number. Uh, it's it's I, I had a ten, I, I think I had a ten. You're held, <laughs> <laughs> and you are about to be depantsed. Top of the order, <laughs> Karen, you're up as the sibling rivalry continues. I'm gonna try and finish this one off. Uh... Wow. wow. <laughs> Uh, 19 and 15. You said 16 hits? 16 hits. Okay, so the one will connect. Uh, that's going to be 
another uh, seven. That's enough to put him down. And while he falls, I am going to use my cat's agility to double my movement speed and go and assess the situation with the cousins. Okay. Uh, Gaga, you're up. <laughs> Come on, ooh la la. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, I, I got to decide, man. Uh, I will go cut down the uh, salamander who's a feared. Now, by you approaching him, does that break the fear? Or does oh. he try and run away from you? And we can start the Benny Hill music. Da, 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 da. Uh, awaken the sense mortality of one creature you can see within range or become frightened. There's no running away. He just has disadvantage on ability checks and attack rolls while I am in line of sight and it can't willingly move closer. Gotcha. Okay. But you're uh, approaching him, right? I'm approaching him. Uh, 19 to hit. Oh, yeah, that hits. And that is going to be 14 damage. Oh, nice. On top of the four you already did. Uh, fair. Then, uh, if at all possible, if I have movement left, I'd like to just step back out of range. Because I'm a dick. Uh, <laughs> you can step out of melee range. You can't step out of fire range. And he'll have disadvantage on an opportunity attack. If you want to take it. Uh, no, I'm not going to take it. Uh, I'm going to spit fire at six. You, Gaga. So DC 11, save for half. Uh, 11 on the die. Uh, half a six, three. Uh, Ericall, you are magically held. Uh, and then it gets awful breezy as your cousin unleashes your breeches or your britches and charges forward. Uh, Karen, if you are still running at him, uh, this lumbering oaf it may run you over, so I would sidestep him if you want. Uh, if you want to try and block him, he's going to run you over to get oh, to Oh, I'm the trying to decide if I'm distracted by the, uh, by the, by the play toy that just appeared. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna. I'm, I'm just gonna roll even odd. <laughs> <laughs> even I go for the shaft. Odd I go for the ball. Balls. <laughs> Ericall, are you a furry or? <laughs> you are first level, so you know might be kind of slim. Slim pickings. Okay, no, I, I know. I, I'm not. My feline instincts do not take over, and I do not feel the need to go swap the swap the uh, cat. Well, we're at the top of the order, Karen. What do you want to do? So I, I will. I will move out of the way okay uh minister justice man is large uh but he's not very fast uh so he continues to charge past you uh with his mace held high he wants some blood artax okay. however is eating some grass <laughs> uh all of the i'm gonna go inspect the saddlebag Okay. Fair enough. Uh, give me an animal handling or get kicked in the teeth. Oh, that's actually not too bad. Uh, that's going to be... Does that will not actually fall off of the horse or it was just loose? Just loose. Okay. A 14? Yeah, that's close enough. Uh, yeah, you can go inspect the saddlebags. Artax gives you the side eye and then continues to eat the grass. Um, rations, uh, basic adventuring gear, uh, a Bible, if you will. Um, uh, did, did this motherfucker have a healing potion for himself? Uh, not in the saddlebags, you don't. Okay. I want his. I, I will take his Bible. Okay, that's fair. <laughs> uh, what's your alignment? Me. Yeah. Uh, chaotic, neutral. Uh, okay. Uh, Gaga. Well, then it's, it's chaotic. A, it's evil. A Twenty on sleight of hand. I mean, there's nobody watching. I mean, Eric Hall's going to snap out of it most likely, but uh, Gaga, you're up. All right. 
Let's make one last attack here. 17. Yep, that hits. Okay. And where are my good dice? Oh, there they are. Uh, five. That is nine more slashing damage. <laughs> That's enough to knock the Fire Newt down. Uh, just as Minister Justice Man gets there panting with some debris on his nose. Uh. <laughs> uh, he turns around and congratulates you, Gaga, and Magnus turns around and goes, hey, pussy, get away from that horse or I will have it attack. <laughs> uh, use insight for me, Karen. Uh, 13. Uh, he ain't kidding. <laughs> I have a feeling I could have rolled a two and figured that one out. Yeah, probably. Uh, Eric, I'll go ahead and give me uh, uh, your wisdom roll. That's uh, 14. You break free from the hold person. You start to get feeling in your fingers and you notice uh, it's breezy down here. <laughs> 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 I I spend the rest of the time trying to pull my pants up and clean my fingers off. Oh, in that order? <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, in that order. Oh. Uh, Minister Justice Man turns around again, congratulates Gaga and Magnus for their stealthy martial skills. Uh, side <laughs> eyes, Karen. Uh, I killed the one. Fuck you because uh, he doesn't like his horse being messed with. And uh, Eric Hall, he points out to you, well done, cousin. You managed to hit him. Oh, wait, that was not you. Nice pants. <laughs> <laughs> he whistles and Artax comes over. He cinches up his saddle, deftly pops into it, and goes, enjoy the spoils of battle. Can I get some healing first? Mighty I'm here. Uh, yeah. I could take a little too. <laughs> He's getting healed. I'll lose the one that I killed. He reaches into his saddlebag, reaches into his other saddlebag. <sighs> if I don't get that fucking Bible back, I'm not healing anyone. <laughs> Do I learn clerical spells now? <laughs> <laughs> You're going to learn something clerical. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, what happens while I'm looting it? I'm going to try and secret it on the body. So, the guy that was nowhere near... Yes. Somehow, magically... Uh -huh. <laughs> yes, yes. No, while, while he was charging, it fell out. He never got up to him before he was he dead. Doesn't, he doesn't remember that. Uh, that's a 19 on insight. Okay. <laughs> It's still it's still on that one's body. What else do I find? Uh, you find a a charging noise of hooves behind you. <laughs> uh, you also find eleven gold pieces. You notice that they are wearing chain mail, and the scimitar is not in bad shape. I will swap out for the scimitar. Uh, give me a perception check. As a mighty cloud of dust approaches. 19. Uh, you fan away the dust as the horse comes charging to you and gives you a nice little love tap with its hip uh, as if it was a Philadelphia flyer and kind of gives you a check. Uh, he's going to jump down, give you a shove, uh, and reach down and grab his Bible. Wipe it off. <laughs> and wave to Magnus and Gaga. <laughs> Come running up. <laughs> Take a knee. Take a knee. <laughs> Cousin, do you need any healing from the battle? No, I'm, I'm fine. I suffered no injuries. Yeah. Just my pride. <laughs> uh, Magnus and, oh. Lucky you guys. Magnus and Gaga, you get eight hit points back. Nice. Woo! Full health! Woo! As the power of his savior courses through him and leads out upon you. <laughs> uh, he looks around, he goes, 
Anybody loot the other body yet? I'm more than I happy to. <laughs> I, I don't care. D12, whoever gets there first. No, go, no, go ahead. I'm, I'm still distracted with the horse. <laughs> still distracted with the horse? Yeah, the uh, horse is a very intimidating figure. 11 on the D12. Uh, it, you only find nine on this one. Uh, it also has uh, chain mail, although it's pretty beat up. Uh, yeah. because this was the physically abused one uh and uh the scimitar okay all right um yeah i'll, I'll collect the scimitar okay uh odd magnus even karen two karen you also found a piece of parchment on uh your looting suspect uh every time you go to read it our tax kind of gives you a yeah. hip check <laughs> <laughs> then, then I'll I, I I I will wait until the horse is gone. It just stares at you. Well, I I'll, I'll, I will wait indefinitely. Okay. I will cast Mage Hand, Invisible One. <laughs> he's gonna fake. The he's gonna fake the <laughs> horse. I'll need a little bit more. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh God. Minister reaches down, no, 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 no. hitches it back up. <laughs> Are we ready, ladies? <laughs> uh, just then, another tremor <laughs> hits. Uh, you are far enough away from the edge that it does not affect you. However, small rocks begin to cascade down from the peaks next to you. That is not good. Can we Leave? go now? Yeah. What are you waiting on? Let's go. I'm waiting for Ericall, the paladin. Oh, oh, chosen. Okay, okay. Let's go. Let's go. Just no need to wait on me. <laughs> Lead on there, pants. <laughs> you used to call me that when I was a kid, and, and they wouldn't let me wear pants. He has also cleaned off the offending smudge on his nose. Uh, yeah. As you continue forward, uh, the rumbles continue to get a little bit rougher and there is a very narrow stretch ahead. Uh, minister calls for a halt. He seems to be inspecting the volcano. Where, where do, which direction is it from where we are? It is to your left. Okay, so we're, we're parallel to it basically. Mm -hmm. you, uh, the mountains are here the trail goes through here and the Missouri River or I'm we sorry have, the Kauai River goes through here we haven't quite passed it yet I guess is what I was asking correct you are dead even with it uh, he furrows his brow and uh, calls out to Ericol cousin what do you think are we fast enough to cross this narrow strait or no I know I am, and I'm brave. I will lead the way. Show us your courage, cousin. And I start running. Tyro, <laughs> never do, mind. Do I need to key up uh, Baywatch again? Baywatch again. <laughs> yeah. I'll be no, no, no. Baywatch nights, because everyone knows everything's everything's hotter. Oh, you uh. Night. Yeah, you did. You weren't in that one. Uh, he was in the sea. Yeah. Uh, anybody gonna follow Ericol? I'm gonna uh, climb on the wall. Uh, yeah, I'll tear after Ericol. <laughs> Gaga. Sure. Uh, Minister points out that his horse is well faster than you guys. He's going to wait a few moments, give you a head start, and then he's also going to haul ass with you. Not to let Ericol's courage outshine his own. <laughs> uh, everybody the runs. The volcano starts to shake again. Uh, rocks fall. Everybody DC 12 versus acrobatics to dodge the cascading sounds. 25. Uh, 6. Uh, 10. Nope. Oh, gee, nine. <laughs> it's hard to run in plate mail, man. <laughs> 19. Uh, he's going to just fucking jump over you bitches. Uh, 
<laughs> so the cat manages to avoid getting struck. Of course. Minister Justice Man's horse has got enough speed to just fly right by. Uh, you other three each take D6. Oh. That's a four. So we each take four. There goes half my health again. <laughs> <laughs> you guys all take a noggin hit. Uh, okay. But yeah. you manage to miss the larger blocks. Uh, you continue to dodge past the strewn or rock strewn uh, passage uh, and get to the other side as the volcano quiets again. Uh, Minister Justice Man is highly concerned and it appears to be realistic and asks if everyone is okay. I have the power of Hawonius, and I'm going to lay and touch myself and heal myself. <laughs> so that's I said you were always good at touching yourself. <laughs> uh, Magnus and Gaga, are you okay? I could use some healing. He pulls I... out a vial out of his belt pouch that was not smashed by falling onto Erikal uh, and says, you guys can only, I've only got the one, so you're going to have to share um, I can second win, so I think I'll do that. <laughs> D8 plus two, no ones. Okay. Oh, back to full health. Uh, you look around, and it seems as though the trail is starting to go onto a descent. Uh, from this viewpoint, you have a great view of the River Kwai. Across the river, you can see fucking farmland, uh, flat land, easy going. Had the bridge been intact, you would have already been to St. Louis. Uh, that is not the case at all. Um, so, I, well, 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 he's distracted with the healing vials. Can I finally read that paper? Sure. It says, cut him off at the pass. Gotcha. The rest of it is torn or been eaten or something. Uh, so you aren't 100% positive that this was a trap. It's a trap. Ah, it's a trap. It's a trap. Uh, as, you <laughs> as you continue on, again, the trail starts to descend. Uh, far off into the distance, you see another bridge. Uh, not quite as nice as the bridge that got burned, but it certainly will cross uh, the River Kwai, uh, assuming you can make it there. Give me perception checks, please. Eight. Eighteen. Ten. Uh, only... Uh, uh, Minister and Karen both hear the faint cries of wolves in the distance. No, don't trust it. Someone's praying wolf. Uh, Artax bristles at the noise and snorts loudly. Uh, I will take animal handling from Ericol, Magnus, and Gaga. Eight. Two. <laughs> Five. We're rocking it, guys. Yeah, we're wow. rocking it. Uh, Minister pats his horse on the neck and says, Lead on, cousin, brave hero that you are, and watch out for the wolves. I will. <laughs> start, start. Starts right. running. <sighs> <laughs> Who wants to and, run after him, if anybody? Uh, um, I'll let him. I'll, I'll, I'll show uh, Thundercock what the uh, note said. Which one's Thundercock? Uh, shithead. Uh, Keep going. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> uh, the bad guy. Uh, not not Ericall. Oh, okay. Uh, his cousin. <laughs> not er er Ericall's cousin. Gotcha. Yeah. Uh, Mister. Huh. Where did you get this? The one that took your Bible had it. Uh huh. Hmm. We need to be on our guard. Apparently somebody knew we were coming. Uh, okay. 
Lead on. Who's uh, second? Gaga, Magnus? Magnus. Uh, I'm running after him. <laughs> What's your speed, Eric Hall, 25? Um, 30. Ooh. Ooh. Very nice. Uh, Magnus, what's yours? 30. Oh, okay. So you can keep up. Gaga? 30. <clears throat> uh, everybody's running along like little ants. Uh, Karen, are you going to go or are you going to get trampled by the horse? I am not going to stay behind. Okay. Uh, he will follow you, trying not to trample you, so he can't go full gallop, uh, and he is... I'll, I'll, I'll use my cats at my feline agility and i'll double my movement speed okay uh yeah he was not feeling great about uh being slowed not uh, feline great uh, uh. well played well played uh one two three four five six eric call uh as you look behind you you start to get a little bit winded uh you're waving everybody up, and here comes a wolf. Uh, leaps onto the trail in front of you. Everybody roll initiative. Oh, nat 20. Oh, 12. 10. Nat 1. Ooh. 14. Uh, Eric Hall, Justice Man, this bastard. Oh, hang on. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> you know, your cousin's not going to be much help this initially uh it's going to put the clamp down on your ass oh shit not with the two uh <laughs> not with a two at all uh 14 is the next highest number that's me yep uh and i will um i will stab him with my uh with my long sword okay AC 14 to hit the wolf. It is 14. a okay. dire wolf. Oh, that's a 19. Of, a lot of hit points. Nice. 19. That's a D8 plus 3. That's 8 plus 3 is 11. 11 hit points. Nicely done. The wolf howls in pain. Uh, next up is the 12. Magnus. That is me. I am going to try to pierce him. Uh, net 20. Nicely done. Damage, reroll damage, add modifiers. Okay. Okay, let's see. 12. 12. And uh, 3. Uh, 24 plus 3, 27. 7, yeah. Nice. Whew, you're making fast work of this one. It's about uh, damn time. <laughs> next up is the 10. Gaga. Ooh la la. I'll run up to the uh, wolf's other side and also attempt to net 20 it. I won't. I'll get a net one, though. Oh, <laughs> you know, no. It's Eric in that situation. Magnus or Eric Hall, odd or even. Magnus will be odd. Eric Hall even. Because they're both attacking. That's Eric Hall. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Oh, not bad. Fine. Uh, four damage. Halved already. <laughs> to Eric Hall. <laughs> uh next up is the four uh the mount thunders forward and the clerical warrior leaps off this is everybody <laughs> with a six i was so hoping for a one <laughs> uh that one karen you're up you know what let me roll a Dex check to make sure I don't die. Okay, yeah. 18. I didn't roll off the cliff. That would look so cool, though. That would. <laughs> uh, 18. It's? I'm assuming a, the six will miss, but that, yep. that'll hit. Uh, that's going to be four plus, plus three plus Seven. five. So that's 12. 12. How are you getting two attacks in? Uh, I'm two short swords, both light weapons. That's all I'm doing. Are you at disadvantage on one of them? Nope, but I don't get to add my modifier to the other. Right. Gotcha. Right. And, and, uh, my, and my sneak attack is the second dice that I'm rolling. Gotcha. If Magnus is engaged with it. Top of the order, the nat 20 will go. All five of you are present. Uh, let's see. 
Ooh. Uh, Eric Hall, your cousin's going to take the hit. Okay. Eric Hall, your cousin's going to take a big hit. Uh, that's 23. 2d6 Damn. plus 3. Man, we should uh, leave him for dead. It's like serious business, guys. Except uh, he's not dead. He does suffer eleven hit points, and he too woo. howls in pain. Uh, Fourteen. Right. I'm going to. I'm going to call out very bravely. I'll save you, cousin. Even though you're you were mean to me. Be a nat one. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, it's an eighteen. Nice. Eighteen hits the dire wolf. And uh, that'll be another eight. Let's see, another 11 hit points of damage. That is enough to sunder the beast. Uh, it releases its hold on your cousin, who angrily holds his arm and kicks the dead beast in the head, smashing it in the jaw. Uh, and, I, and I look to my cousin for approval. <laughs> <laughs> uh anybody want to do anything with the dire wolf uh he doesn't have any healing potions left so ah. um unfortunately my survival is zero so skinning it would be that'd be animal handling that would be animal handling mm -hmm. yeah again that is zero <laughs> so and the way you've been rolling, you'll probably cut off Eric. Hey, I, this is a AL legal character, so it's like fair enough. Uh, yeah, Karen isn't going to skin skin an animal for once. No, oh, fair enough. Uh, Minister goes over to his horse, checks the saddle, <laughs> <laughs> and uh, pops up onto uh, his mount and wraps some bandages around his arm. Uh, 17, his medicine check is out of this world. Oh, wow. <laughs> uh, anybody be offended if I lead? Oh, no, go right ahead. Go right ahead. <laughs> uh, you continue on down uh, the descent of the mountain uh, and you reach the bridge. He holds up his fist, international symbol for SWAT to hold. Uh, to walk to you continue to walk oh, forward. Shit, yeah. <laughs> Didn't know what that meant. Well, your head isn't up your ass. It's up our taxes ass. Ah, ah. <laughs> he holds. Everybody go ahead and do an insight check. Thirty twenty. Uh, only Karen notices there is no sound whatsoever. Even coming from the river. The river is still roaring, but there are no birds. Okay. Why are we stopping? Something is amiss here. This is the pass. Allow oh. me to go forward and check this out. You need any help, cousin? Let, let me check this out. I'm I'm still a lot healthier than you. Uh, he nudges okay. he nudges Artax forward and begins to cross over the bridge, which is a span of about 40 feet. Still a, a marvel of engineering, but uh, you know, it's not the golden gate. And he gets across, he dismounts, looks around. And signals you guys forward. I bravely go. Yeah. Her calls across. I watch. Magnus. I watch behind us as I proceed to. I kill the dire wolf. I kill the dire wolf. I let you kill the dire wolf, pal. <laughs> <laughs> I was holding on to it with my hand. <laughs> uh, Karen, there's nobody coming up the rear. Everybody else makes it across. Uh, minister is examining the ground uh, and he's looking around. 
Someone pissed here. <laughs> uh, Magnus, Eric Cole, and Gaga, did you want to do anything? I pull out a wine skin of some good wine and say, hey, Eric Cole, you did kill the dire wolf. And then I also pull out a napkin for the inevitable drip. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. I know how you do this. <laughs> Thanks, Phil. This is how you do this, right? Yeah. Drinking yeah. on oh, the oh. Uh, okay. You, you, you keep it. I don't need it. I, I don't want it. Minister Justice Man frowns disapprovingly. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And he's smelling. Oh. Uh, he's like something something has been by here war cries approach out of the woods everybody roll initiative uh oh there we go 18 Ooh, 12 better. net 20 16 uh net 20 uh seven kobolds charge out into the I'm, open i'm going to have to insist on holding until i can do a sneak attack that's fair. Uh, 18, error call. I'll, uh, I'll uh, take a javelin and throw it, at, uh, throw it at a cobalt. Go ahead. AC 12. Or, well, yeah, I, I, I guess, is this a, yeah. do we get a ranged round? Is that essentially what's happening? Uh, they're closing. Uh, you can wait because they will be within melee range when it's their turn. Okay. You guys are very 16, close. That'll be a total of six hit points of damage. That puts one of them down. Uh, next up are the two 16s, unless um, Karen wants to go. Okay, two 16s. Gaga and uh, Minister Justice Man. I will cast... Yeah, now nah. we'll just kill him. I'll run up, stab him. A AC twelve. Uh, that'll work. Uh, seventeen. And that'll then... kill one. Oh, not seventeen, unless uh, eleven to hit or eleven damage. Oh yeah, that kills him. Okay, they're kobolds, man. This is fucking easy. <laughs> uh, uh, you hear the clomp of footstep or hoof prints as Minister Justice Man charges forward. He allows Artax to run over one and he leaps from his saddle to try and hit the other. Artax will be green. He will be the orange. 18 for Artax, 16 plus four. Uh, they're both going to hit. Artax is going to fucking kill this thing with eight hit points. He fucking kills that one. Uh, Justice Man does plus two plus one. kills his. However, he is going to be attacked at advantage as it is their turn. Mm. Attack tactics, yeah. Uh, 12 plus four is 16. He's going to get hit again. Two more damage. 13. Uh, there are two left. I will go after uh, the one, the, the, If any of them are within five feet of anyone, I'll take my turn. Uh, go ahead. Uh, but they are attacking. So go ahead. There are okay. three total. Okay. Uh, that's going to be... There's one on Magnus, one on Gaga, one on Minister. Uh, Magnus. Uh, it's going to be uh, 17, 17 to hit. Yep. And uh, 19 to hit. Okay. So that's going to be four plus three is seven plus six plus six. He's is, dead. Yeah. Magnus, as uh, Karen kills yours, he lunges forward with a one and falls at your feet. Uh, Gaga, uh, 16 plus four, dirty 20. And uh, we'll cast shield and that misses. Okay. Uh, and 
Air or Air Call's cousin already got hit. So we move to the top of the order. Karen. Uh, I will go after ministers. Okay. Uh, and that's going to be. Do, 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 do. 22 and 10. Uh, the 22 hits. Okay, that's going to be 5 plus 3 is 8 plus 4 is 12. Dead. Uh, 18. Error call. <laughs> uh, is there one close to my cousin? Uh, not anymore. <laughs> the, on, the only one left is Gaga's. Okay. Gaga's been nice to me. <laughs> Your cousin's been moderately nice. Comparatively. <laughs> Comparatively. That, that is uh, 11 plus 5. That's a 16. 16 hits. 1d8 plus 4 plus 3 is 7 hit points of damage. Slashing. Dead. Seven kobolds dead, one with a hoof print, dead center of the face. <laughs> <Boom. laughs> mm. Our tax has found more grass to graze. Nice. I start searching the bodies. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, yeah. There are seven. Minister does not give a shit. Uh, everybody roll a d12. Uh, the low roll gets only one body. Three. Seven. Eleven. Twelve. Magnus, three gold. Ericol, Karen, Gaga, six gold. Uh, they have slings on them, uh, and they're also using daggers as weapons. Uh, other than that, they have nothing. They uh, light the armor. I could, I, I'll take a sling while I'm here. That'll be handy. And I'll, okay. I'll re-equip some daggers. Uh, Minister Justice Man has found his humility and says, thanks. <laughs> 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 Didn't find a lot of humility. He just found <laughs> barely enough. Uh, he calls for Artax, but Artax does not come. Artax is dead. Artax is looking at something. Uh, minister stomps his foot, snaps his finger, and the horse reluctantly comes over. What do I, I go and look at see what Artex was 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 checking out. Two dead bodies, Ooh. dressed as merchants. It would appear human, uh, both males. I, hey, cousin, looky here. What? <laughs> I, there, there, are, there are more dead bodies here. Maybe, maybe we should take a look and see what killed them. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> so I, 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 I perform a very thorough <laughs> and and exhaustive uh, check. I, I, I check their their feet, I, I, I take off their shoes, I check for hidden compartments in their souls, I, I, I check for all sorts of shit. Fair Can enough. I take a short rest while he does that? <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, uh, instructor justice man is going to go the full length, so yes, I'll, I'll give a short rest, uh, and minister justice man also confirms that's probably a good idea. Uh, Ericol, I will take medicine checks, two of them, to start. Okay. Uh, medicine's not my best. I'm gonna losing a lot here. Okay. So that's a uh, six and uh, fourteen. Uh, the fourteen, you recognize one of the merchants has had his throat slit by a <laughs> shitty dagger. Uh, you cannot find the cause of death on the other one. Hmm. I'll forego the short rest to help him and have him re-roll. Re-roll the six. Yeah, that'll be an 18 this time. Uh, right up Main Street, there's a hole in his uh, trousers. <laughs> yeah, apparently he took one in the hoo-ha. 
God. Ooh, how <laughs> painful that is. Uh, any, next. Any, mm -hmm. Go ahead. No, no, no. I, I, I wasn't going to say anything important. Two investigation checks, one for each. Are you still helping? I would assume as much, yes, because I'm, I'm not going to benefit from the rest. Gotcha. That's an eight and a two, and that's not my best skill. <laughs> <laughs> so, so with the, with the it's, 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 that's an intelligence-based one, and that's not really his strong suit. Sweet, you know, that's... Would you rather help me? I, yeah, I, I, I don't really know what I'm looking at. The, 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 I, I, I know how they were killed, but I, I don't know what I'm looking for. Eric Hall and I went to the same public school, so apparently <laughs> that—that's why we need to defund the police and take that money <laughs> and put it in public education. If if so, if, if you know what Karen, you're looking for, then, I, I, then I maybe I can help you. An investigation. And the other one. Uh, the other There's one. There's two bodies. Uh, it's the high is going to be a 19. Yeah, you find both. Uh, yeah. it, it appears as though from their finery before it was sullied with blood, uh, was very nice. And it appears as though these guys might've been textile merchants. However, a quick look around, uh, does not reveal any textiles in the area. You do, however, notice a small trail rather fresh, Leading deeper into the woods. But into the woods. Cousin, did you <laughs> find anything? Um, well, one of these guys got a dagger in the ass and it killed him. Was it and, you? And, and, <laughs> and, and we think that these, uh, and I, I tend to care, and I, I'm not exactly sure how he found this, but there seems to be a trail into the woods. They're, they're, they, these gentlemen were in the import export business. Uh, well, leave Costanza alone. We got a appointment to keep and it's starting to get dark here. I don't want to be out here in the frontier after dark with four novices. But so surely, surely your deity would, would not. My deity's name is not Shirley. <laughs> you didn't call your deity Shirley. I said, I called you Shirley and invoked your deity. Uh, would not permit you to pass by such atrocities as having the the common man slain in cold blood for theft. Yes, she would. <laughs> <laughs> well, mine would not. Erroneous demands justice. I will give you five minutes and then I am leaving because I start our job is to send the pack. Oh God. Uh, <laughs> okay. I, I, I can hear, I can hear Baywatch in the background. Yeah. This time I'm right on his heels. Okay. Yeah. Uh, go ahead. Each of you give me an investigation check. Uh, 18. 18. Uh, you, you both see what caused the trail, a black bear, uh, roll for initiative. I turn around and start running the other way. <laughs> <laughs> bears coming right to us. Those bears will fucking kill you. What uh, was it, 14. Karen? Mine was a 16 and I'm going to do the exact same thing. <laughs> yeah. That's I'm a just 10. <laughs> uh, I see this coming to me and I'm like. Magnus, were you taking the short rest or were you going? Uh, I, I was. I was at the end of the trail with them, so I was behind them. Gaga, uh, you and Minister are fine. <laughs> All right. He, he is waiting impatiently. Jesus Christ! Uh, you guys see the bear, which gets the Jesus. <laughs> now one. Uh, you guys see the bear go full on retreat, uh, correct? Yeah. Everybody yeah. roll a d12 against me, please. That's a 12. Uh, mine's a nine. <laughs> Three. Uh, the bear does not notice you. 
So even you screaming get, retreat. You, get, you guys come running back down the trail. Gaga and Minister look at you. <laughs> Brave Sir Robin. Disapprovingly. <laughs> that bear ate out their assholes. That well, what did you find? That bear didn't kill him because that bear didn't have a dagger up its ass. <laughs> and, uh, we 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 found uh uh um uh tell them what 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 i think it was a bear bear a bear, <laughs> bear. in the woods yeah, a bar no, and there was. there's a lot of bear in the woods you know why that's where they shit cousin no, no actually <laughs> bears, bears shit in caves are but we he, ready he, to anyway, go? Are you bringing us, this so. fucking thing back? <laughs> no, no, no. He, he he didn't see us. We 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 were able to stealthily get away. No, we slew it. We slew it bravely and boldly. Great. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it is starting to get very dark, and he suggests. We double time this, uh, and he is going to lead the way because he is sick and tired of this, and he wants to get this job done. He has something waiting for him. Uh, I love quick time parch. Quick time parch. As, Hutch. as Hutch. you guys travel, uh, the sun is really starting to set over the mountains, uh, and you are on a marked trail uh, at a crossroads. You see a large stone pillar uh, indicating roots of travel uh as you look to the right back towards podunk uh you see fucking great land i mean it's easy to traverse there's no problems uh <laughs> it, it would have taken you like a couple hours and you would have been fine uh to the left uh, where uh, justice or where minister says you're going to st louis the pillar indicates st louis is that way there's a rise into the hills, uh, and the road here is very well traveled. I will I will take nature checks from all of you, please. Oh. Note to self, do not make dumb characters. <laughs> Three. Thirteen. Eighteen. Seven. Uh, Erica, you notice uh, well-traveled tracks. You also spot a gem in the road, partially covered in mud. I pick it up. It is a peridot worth 15 gold pieces in a teardrop formation. Uh, congratulations, you found yourself some wealth. Uh, your cousin has just fucking bypassed this. His horse uh, starts dropping turds uh, and he starts to climb. And then comes to a sudden halt and raises his hand. Do you guys stop? Sure. Sure. <laughs> I'm, I'm admiring the first bit of treasure I've ever collected Something. on my adventuring career. So I'm, so I'm not really staring at his hand. I'm like, you're like, ah, my precious, my, my precious first gemstone. I'm going to make a necklace out of this. And, and I'm going to wear it. And then one day, when I find a beautiful woman, I will give it to her. You hear, hold. I, I, have, I have a 12 charisma. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. Uh, on the rise, you see a lone figure. Yes, you see a lone figure. Uh, minister appears apprehensive he pulls out something from his other pocket extends it and looks slams the telephone oh, this is your chance that guy is terrified of that guy in the distance you should charge after him Show your cousin <laughs> once. you can do it I'll be right you behind see, you do you think that if I do that then maybe Maybe my cousin will finally with me. He turns around and says, shut no. up, stupid. This, <laughs> this is something bad. <laughs> hang, I'm very brave. Hang, hang out here. Do it. I, I'm going to approach. Uh, oh. You notice that the sole individual 
is wearing a rather dark, expensive looking robe uh, and does not have a mount. Uh, minister charges forward, mace held high. The individual stands ready. You can see little spurts of energy between his fingers. As minister gains uh, distance on him, he comes to a screeching halt and turns around and says, so long, suckers! <laughs> and rides right past the creature. Oh. Radiating energy. <laughs> oh, what a dick. <laughs> Your cousin is a dick. <laughs> the creature in the dark robes begins to walk towards you. His name is probably Palpatine. Uh, <laughs> I will take initiative from everybody. Oh, man. 17 plus 3, dirty 20. 11. 15. 4. <laughs> Gaga. 21. Oh. Uh, Gaga's up first. Uh, this creature uh, who is cloaked, you cannot see, is headed right for you. Uh, you can see that it has a weapon on its back and it's radiating electricity that seems to be turning red. Actually, no. No, it, I, I'm changing my mind on that one. It's radiating electricity between its fingers. Okay. You're up first. Uh, how far away? About 90 feet. 90 feet. So and closing. Off. Uh, I will cast Mold Earth, and I will kind of make a little trench about 30 feet in front, run forward, hop in it, so I have some cover if he decides to do a lightning bolt. <laughs> 1917, boys and girls. And Skimmy. Oh, man. Mind you, there's also now a five-foot cubic of dirt on top of the road that you can hide behind, too. That's true. I think they can all jump behind it. Yeah. Uh, he is progressing for, he or she is progressing forward. Uh, I will hold my action uh, 15. Is oh yeah, I'm, I'm dipping behind it. Uh, to, try, oh, to effectively try and hide. Fair enough. 11. Uh, I'm going to beat Cheeks to join Karen. <laughs> <laughs> Last, take a knee. <laughs> last but not least, Aracol, you notice that this creature is starting to mold the electricity a little bit more, and it is growing in intensity, and the distance is getting cut shorter and shorter. What so, would you like so to do? Let, 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 let me get this straight. My, my cousin, just, who's... Just, just basically bailed on us. Just roll. Did he turn around and roll the other way, or did he? No, no, no. He mocked us as he as he went past it. Correct. He, so he so long, suckers. He, he's in a so, so he he, he basically pretended to charge it, and instead of doing anything, just just kept going. He's yep. in a he's in allegiance with it. You've seen Braveheart. He's the Irish. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I, I I have a have a small come to Jesus moment, and uh, draw my sword slowly off my back. Well, I suppose this is how it's going to end. And I I take my sword and shield and start running down the mountain bravely. <laughs> I'm actually, <laughs> running up the mountain. Yeah. <laughs> like perpendicular. To the <laughs> So yes, I, I'm I am a lawful good paladin, a Peronius who does not shy away from combat. I will charge the fucker. Fair enough. Uh, 90 feet away, so I can't do anything else except double move and close it to 60 feet. Right. Eric Hall, uh, small shards of lightning shoot out and pepper the ground in front of you as the spellcaster has clearly fucked up his distance ratio. Uh, and has not come close to hitting you. Uh, the closer you get, give me a perception check. That is uh, an 11. 
it resembles the fire newts you guys faced off with earlier. Okay. Uh, top of the order, uh, 21. Uh, Gaga, what you got for me? We'll cast False Life on myself. And <laughs> I will charge forward right behind Eric Hall. Yeah. Fair enough. Uh, I had the Dirty 20. I am looking up the spell on what it does. Oh, Lord. <laughs> That's not good. Okay, fair enough. Uh, so let's see. Only Gaga and Ericol are out in the open at this point in time, right? Right. Correct. Yep. I would like to say Ericol is a nice bigger target, though. <laughs> sure would. Uh, each of you give me a uh, DC 12 versus Charisma. Ah, shit. Jesus. <laughs> oh, <no>. <laughs> uh, 14. <laughs> I mean, I, I mean, I, I rolled a one, but I get a plus three in my crystal. So I, I, it, the, the net effect is a four, but I rolled a one. Uh, <laughs> you take six hit points of damage and Gaga, you take three. As primordial energy rips through you. Are you still up, Eric Hall? Barely. <laughs> uh let's go with the 15. That's uh, cat. Oh, have they closed the distance yet? Uh they they will when they get their attack. And I'm going to hold. Okay. Uh no, 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 I will. How far am I then? How far was this pile of earth? You were able to make it in one turn. Well, we were uh, 30 feet away. Apart, 30 feet. So you should be 60 unless. Okay, so I can so since I didn't move, I can use my I, I can double my movement speed again. So okay, I'm fine. So yeah, I'm gonna hold. Okay. Hold! <laughs> hold 11, Magnus. Okay, I use my movement to, to catch up to uh Ericol and Gaga. And I'm gonna make a ranged attack with a hand axe. Please be a one. Please be a one. Please be a one. <laughs> right there, calls back. Still, it's not a one, but I miss. It's a ten. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Dink on ice. Eric Hall, uh <laughs> static electricity still coursing through your body. What do you want to do? Um, I'm only 30 feet away now, so I will throw a javelin, uh, and then I'll close the rest of the feet. Um, I'll throw a javelin and then use my move to move the rest of 30 feet to get within. Sure, go ahead. And I'll, I'll throw the javelin first, maybe break his concentration. AC 13 to hit this guy. Is a, 20, is a 23 going to hit? Yep, 23 hits. So 26 plus 3. That's a 5 plus 3. That's 8 hit points of damage. Okay. Uh, as the end rounds or as no, no, the no, no, round no. ends, Karen, are you doing anything or no? Yeah, once the distance is closed and and we're and, and there's another creature that's within five, it's within and five feet of him. Yeah, so then I'm going to go ahead and using my feline agility, I'm doubling my movement speed. So now I'm moving 60 and I'm going to double attack this thing. Uh, so that's going to be. Come on, baby. Uh, 18 and a 24. Both hit. So it's going to be four plus three is seven plus three is 10 plus one, 11. Uh, you said 11? Yes. Got it. Uh, top of the order. Got and, it. I'm, and I'm dead center faced off with it. That's fine. Gaga, you're up. I will run up and hack at it with a great sword. Okay. Up nat 20. Nice. Oh, nice. Oh, yes. Finally. <laughs> so, 
Oh, fuck, this is going to hurt. It, I hope so. Cause I hope so. You guys, are, you guys are in a little bit of deep shit here, if not. So 18, uh, 22 uh, points of slashing damage. That's going to hurt, but it is going to hellish rebuke your ass. No, it's not. <laughs> Uh, you need to make a dex saving throw, please. 12. Uh, that is what you need. So it attempts to hellish rebuke you, but it fails. Uh, say again. Half it. Hellish rebuke should be had. Oh, is it? Yeah. Okay. Correct. Uh, six hit points of damage. Okay. Uh, it will attack, and there's four of you here. Three. Uh, Karen, let's see if I hit you with fire. Nat 20. Uh, that is going to be the firebolt. Eight hit points of damage. Uh, and it's Karen's attack, so give me your death save. That one, that one, that one. Come on, Karen. Uh, pass. Okay. Uh, next up, 11, Magnus. Okay. I'm going to swipe uh, this. Gaga, how much did you do again? 22. Okay. That's what I thought. Because <laughs> my notes are jumbled here. Okay, I'm going to join the fray. And okay. Walter Frey. Walter Frey. Oh, no, 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 Walter Frey. Uh, 22. Hits. Okay. And I strike him for 12. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, he is significantly wounded. Ericol, can you put him out of his misery? I'm going to try. I'm right there, so I'm going to have my long sword. Uh, I'm going to drop my shield and, and attack with uh, attack using as a two-handed weapon. So More damage. damage. Right. That's going to be an 18 plus 5 is a 23. He's got three hit points left. So D10 plus th that's seven hit points of slashing damage. Off with his head, the Fire Newt Warlock succumbs to the injuries. Uh, at this point in time, Eric Hall, Justice Man, is covered in blood, as is odd even. One, Magnus, who was standing too close. Uh -oh. uh, one of your colleagues is down. Oh, shit. Uh, I call hey, attention. Go get that cousin of yours, Eric Hall. Let's go! Quick! My next death save was a nat 20, so I'm up. Okay. Um, and she's up. <laughs> would you like to chase down your cousin who is on horseback? I need a break. <laughs> no, I, uh, I, uh, I think we're going to, uh, we're going to maybe, I'm going to suggest something. So I think I've learned something very important here today. You can't count on family, but you can count on friends. I look at my compatriots there. It's been a very noble moment for myself. I think we've earned ourselves a West. And an you, East. <laughs> you attacked like a warrior poet, my friend. So. <laughs> yeah, I'll... I'll... <laughs> I, 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 I think we should make a campfire and take a long rest. And oh. uh, that way I could at least lay on hands in the morning and get uh, and get uh, Karen. Uh, back up a little bit. Um, well, we'll be full after the rest. I'm going to search the warlock. Uh, wow, finally, some, somebody was paying attention. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, the warlock has a bag of gems, and inside that gem is a small amulet. Oh, okay. Uh, I, I, the gems are 75 gold pieces. Wow. Okay. Um, yeah, I will divvy it up. <laughs> Um, and uh, show the amulet to Eric Hall. I said, "Does this look like anything 
looks like a cameo. A cameo? Okay. Uh, does it look like a like a like an arcane focus or a, or a holy symbol or anything like that or an unholy symbol? Looks or stolen. Looks stolen, probably off those merchants. So they were textile okay. merchants. Yeah. Yeah, the gems and everything probably came from them. So we're doing a long rest? Oh no. I <laughs> believe so. I haven't taken yes. a short rest. I can I can use hit dice just to heal back up if, if we want to just do a brief rest and then go into the village. City. Well City of Saint um, Louis. We don't we don't we don't have the relic anymore, do we? No. He always, he always had it. Yeah, he always had it. Okay. Well, what what do you guys think? You think we should take a long rest or a short rest? I think a long rest would be better served in the city. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'd be inclined to believe that too. So maybe right. a sh- short rest and then work into the city. Okay. Dark- Darkness has fallen. You make the incline climb up to the city gates. Uh, it sits off on a plateau, hence you couldn't see the lights. Uh, the door guard, the gate guards uh, yell down to you from the bastion, Hark, who goes there? I'm Another Karen card. and I need to speak to your manager. <laughs> you hear a you hear a zip. <laughs> I will, I will. And it begins to rain. <laughs> we, we, oh, we we uh, I, I am Eric called Justice Man. My cousin abandoned us on the field of honor, and we seek shelter for the night so that we may demand justice from the Archbishop of Odimara. What he's okay. saying is uh, <laughs> what he's saying. <laughs> what he's saying is I need oh, to see no, the horse. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the gates grind open and you were allowed entry. Okay. Uh, the guard at the bottom goes, "What do you want?" Where we, we need, need to know we, the we wanted to go and play for the night, but we could get down to the ball. <laughs> I hate adventurers. <laughs> we need to know where the where the church of Olimawa is, and we need to know where an inn where we can rest and we cook from our wounds. Willie. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he points over to the left and says, "There's inns and taverns over there." Points to the right, up high, and you see some spires. That is the Temple of Olimar, where the bishop is at. Move along. Move along. along. We, 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 we move along. Nothing to see. Nothing to see. Oh. Just burst. Uh, well, well, we're in town. You think we're we, we going to start a fire? oh no surprisingly you guys have survived uh to reach st louis uh since none of you asked i will just flat out tell you yeah he did not come in here oh well at least we're in a safe place (laughs) yeah Yeah, we, we we couldn't have we couldn't have tracked him down on foot anyways you could have said hey uh did a guy that looks like this come by here? <laughs> <laughs> this guy look familiar to you? We're, we're, not in, we're not in any condition to, to give chase anyways, though. Yes. Uh, uh, Minister good. Justice Man was set up to be the bad apple, as Eric Hall, Justice Man, will certainly go ahead and confirm. And now we have a recurring villain. That that was the <laughs> we do. that was the major reason. So yeah. uh, I am kind of technically surprised that you all survived. <laughs> I was waiting for a long rest before I started killing everybody. The short rest actually helped you guys out. So, yeah. uh, were, let me ask you this: Were you surprised that he fucked you over? No, I was. Yes. Ooh, no, Frank, you created the character. Uh, yeah, exactly. Uh, I, I was surprised, you guys. So, <laughs> I thought this yeah, was going to yeah. be a comedic element between him and Eric. I'll just keep going and going until we. Oh, finish. That's what he does to lighten the load. But then he goes back to the usual asshole and and, and screws <laughs> us over. <laughs> I, was, I, I was actually surprised. I I I, I was surprised that that, that was, I was surprised. 
Okay. Yeah. Uh, says the man who loosened the saddle. <laughs> uh, we'll go final thoughts. Uh, Kyle, final thoughts. Dick. <laughs> 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 Blake, final thoughts. I have some. I have some. Uh, in, I, I have some things that I need to. I'm, I'm going to be filing reports. There's going to be disciplinary hearings, uh, uh, and most likely there's going to be some uh, uh, termination papers sent out. I just want you all to know. Uh, smell my finger, Scott. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Yeah. <laughs> Horse no, I, that, that was good. That was good. I, I hadn't played in a while. It's always great playing with you guys. And uh, it's uh, it, it was fun. It was fun. That was it threw me for a real loop to put someone in my family in the background. That was uh, that was a nice twist. That Thank was you. awesome. Yeah, I actually came up with that a couple of weeks ago. Kyle and uh, Carol both uh, got bounced on it. Uh, to see yeah. how it would go. Uh, David, final thoughts. Uh, I loved it. Uh, we got to see the further adventures of Eric Hall, Justice Man. <laughs> I, I'm actually glad Eric Hall survived. You yeah, others I am too. didn't have <laughs> One hit point. <laughs> <laughs> good thing I joined the fray. <laughs> One hit point. Uh, I was, uh, that, that six that, that you did there, that wait, the four, uh, I had five hit points. Yeah, I had I had one hit point left. Wow. The, the damage was pretty low uh, yeah. from what I could have rolled. So you guys got fairly lucky there. Uh, folks, this has been Murder Hobo Inc. Saturday Night One Shot Edition. Remember, if you want to join us, go ahead and let us know. Follow us on Twitch. Follow us on Twitter. Take a look at our archive if you want to buy our cool stuff. Uh, it's there. If you want to chat with us on Discord, uh, it's there. Let us know. Uh, but most importantly, if you want to have some fun and just enjoy a couple hours getting away from real life, uh, let us know. Uh, in the meantime, for all of us here at Murder Hobo Inc., thanks for joining us. Don't forget to wash your hands and stay out of the uh, stay out of the Buffalo, New York area, because those cops are dicks. So, <laughs> bye everybody. Bye, everybody. <laughs> wash your hands. Have fun stone in the castle. <laughs>